Okay, we are here going to look at another problem, um, which is a sum and difference problem. So in this example, uh, we have a mom and a son, and their total weight is 200 pounds. So that's the sum. Okay, so in this case, the sum is 200 pounds. And the, the mom is 60 pounds heavier than the son, so the difference is 60 pounds, okay? And uh, we need to figure out how much does the mom weigh. So let's use the same method we discussed before, the method of graph. And we're going to draw a bar that represents how much the mom weighs, and another how much the sun weighs. Okay, and the mom weighs more, and the difference here, this, here of course I cannot draw circles or anything that way, just say this is the difference is 60. Okay, and then if I add the 60 pounds to the sun, then they will have the same weight. And the total weight will be, in this picture, it will be, well, original total is 200 pounds. That's the sum. And now I added 60 pounds to the sun's weight. So it will be 260. And that's the total weight in the picture. And so mom has half of the total. So mom weighs half of it, 260 of 2 equals 130, okay. So, this solves the problem, okay. And now I'm going to also discuss another method which is use algebra. I mean, Using algebra, you don't need to draw these pictures. You can use the following algebraic equations. So the sum is 200. Mom plus the sum is 200. And the difference, mom minus the sum, the difference is 60. Okay. And now you have two equations written this way. And you can just add them. So add two equations. So what happens if you add is that if you add m plus s plus 200, okay, and then you add m minus s, that's 60. And this is kind of exactly what we're doing with the picture here. We just add 200 with 60. That's what you do. And you get 260. And here, what do you get? Well, because you have plus s and you have minus s, the plus and minus will cancel. So you are left with m plus m. So that's exactly what we said, is that the twice of the mom's weight will be 260. So that will also imply twice of mom's weight to a 60, mom was 130, half of 260. So, indeed, you can also use this method of algebra to solve the same problem. Okay.